They kind of suck when it comes to long range, but. Oh. I well, see they dropped most of them. Ah! You hide the drone behind them. Yeah, that's why I'm behind you guys, so hopefully he aims at you. Hey, Ghost Lead. What's up? How you doing? You suck ass for not reviving me last time. Wish this was Battlefield 3. I could run your ass over with this damn drone. Oh, they cleared it. Uh, well, they're not all, you know, that bad, apparently. I was hoping, I was hoping to get them killed. But, you know... They just had to go and live on me. Hey guys, how you doing? I was back there shooting them too. I, I, I was with you guys the whole way, trust me. Go team. Keep your heads down. If the dead chopper spots us, it'll get messy real fast. Yeah, 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 yeah don't I care. I got a rifle in here. Over by the command post. Yeah. Watch it. You're about to get spotted. He's moving. I've got eyes on a hostile chopper. Ahead of us. Uh, that look, kind of looks like a Kasatka. There's another one. Twelve o'clock. Add two more hostiles. But I am no helicopter professional. Because mostly all, most Russian gunships look similar anyway, so I'm just going to say Kasatka. Because it kind of looks like the one from Metal Gear. And that was a Kasatka. Although, could be a Hind D. Except I don't remember the Hind D having the barrel in the front. So I'm going to go with Kasatka. Because I think that was the same one that was... In Rambo. Rambo 3, I believe. That had the Russian guy in it that he took out with the explosive bow and arrow. Mounted MG. To the right. Inside the building there. Crack. Snackle. Snappity snap. You're gonna get spotted. I'm around the corner. I'm about to say, if he spotted me, I was gonna be pissed. Up there on the roof. On oh, the roof. Oh. Is the chopper saying or is he saying it? Okay, nope, that is him. Gather into. Okay, so I'm working my way that way. I will go around this way. See if I can't cut through some of these buildings. Got eyes on another one. Straight ahead. Camo activated. Ah, I hate the way they make you stand up like that. You sneak by this guy. Look oh shit! Watch it. There's another one ahead of us. Target eliminated. Crackety crack crack. Hopped over this wall. Whoa! See how they just make you stand up every time you vault or something like that? Hate that. I wish they would keep me in, you know, crouch mode until I turned it off. Ah, but we all can't be picky. And every game can't be 100%. So we're going on top of the gas station? Okay. Could have swore the guy said it was in a car. The trunk specifically. Maybe that's just where the marker is. Because I don't see... On the move. It's supposed to go in the, go in the gas station? Because I don't see no ladder. Not unless I just missed it. Not unless I'm supposed to get a cutscene once they get over here.
Oh, okay. There we go. That's what I thought. Open the car. Oh, we're waiting for some eye. Gotcha. Overlord, we've secured the intel. We're ready to extract. Roger that, Hunter. Testing's on route to the LC. Watch, I probably gotta take out that chopper or something. It's just, Cause otherwise it, it wouldn't just be sitting right there. I probably got to go to the LZ and then once we get there the chopper's going to come and that's when we got to take out the chopper in order for our chopper to land and pick us up. And that's probably how it's going to go down. And the LZ's all the way back where we came. Great. Just try to sneak past it real quick while ain't nobody over on this side of this field. I like how they that they made this game. I would say it's difficult for the average gamer, but I wish they'd have made it a whole lot harder. I mean, I know for me. The only time when I really die is when I, you know, when I personally fuck up. But if I was on my game playing, you know, 100% seriously, then it's like just, you know, it, it's too easy, you know. But then, I mean, I can understand why they don't make it as difficult as they could, because then nobody would really play it. You would have that audience like myself who likes, you know, difficult games, but then that would be it. They have to make it casual to a point to make it somewhat fun, to make it feel like you're progressing and all of that mess for the average person. I wish they would have like a stealth game like this that was like old that was like an old school stealth game where you had to go through this whole mission and not be detected, you know? Like in, you know, like how Smunna Cell used to be. And have like every mission be like that. That's why they called you ghosts. <laughs> Cause you went on the mission and you were not detected, you know? But the average, you know, the average casual gamer wouldn't be able to play it then, because they'd be like, "Oh man, it's too hard. We can't, you know, you can't do it." And this whole camo thing is cool. Don't get me wrong, I love it, but it makes the game too easy. Because otherwise, I'm just walking the whole game, not firing a shot like I'm doing now. You know. You know. See, whenever somebody look at you, you can just do that, and hey, look, they don't see you. He should still be looking at me right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, I wish the guards would walk over to you, like in Metal Gear. Like when, like if he saw me, he should walk, be walking over to me and be like, "What is that?" And look over there and come, and come down next to me and then look at me and then he would find me. You know, instead of just following and, and continuing on with the same route. Come on, guys. Why are y'all all the way over there? The extraction is over here. Rarely missing those options that was in, um, what was it, Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter 2? Where you can hit a button and have the squad regroup on you? Or you can take control of them? Really missing that option right now. Alright, let's see if I can, see if I can drop this dude. Target down. And then drop him over here. Because maybe I gotta clear the extraction. And then drop this dude over here. Hostile down. There we go. I'm reloading. Oh, now y'all sprint. <laughs> See, I do all the work, and now they want to come like you know, like they did something. Come on now, y'all fucking suck. What's the point of having teammates then? If 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 the mission's all on me. I mean, what good are y'all? Just so I can shoot three extra people in a firefight? Or take three extra people by surprise? Come on now. Bullshit. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not liking that so far. How like they they don't really they help you out when it comes to firefights, but like um, or synchronous, you know, sinking targets to take out. But I don't have to take out targets like that. I can go through the whole game by myself. 
take out one or two people in those synchronous shot spots and then have the other guy see me and just shoot my way out and then move on. I don't need them. <laughs> I don't know. They seem like it's, they're more of a hindrance than a you know than a benefit. But maybe that's just me.